on i feel like i haven't done a proper vlog in a while so i just wanted to make a little catch-up video with you guys to show you what i've been up to recently I always like to start off my day by making a nice hot matcha latte using Thea Matcha's products. This isn't sponsored or anything, I just really love their brand and I also love the fact that they're also New Zealand owned. I used to use a bamboo whisk to mix everything together but recently I like to use their mini electric whisk as it's way easier to clean. And pro tip, to easily froth your milk, you can just put it in a coffee plunger and microwave it for about a minute just to warm it up a little. And afterwards, you can just manually froth it using the plunger for as long as you'd like. And just like that, you have yourself a nice creamy matcha latte. My mom has made some homemade lemon custard spread which I love to eat with my toast. breakfast, I decided to study for this course that I'm currently taking online. I've been wanting to slowly upskill myself around UX and UI, so I took up classes on UX design as well as a little bit of web dev and Python. Now one thing that Ms. Corona has taught me back when I was in uni doing online classes is that you really need to set your goals and create a schedule that will help you reach those goals. I usually create daily to-do lists on Notion that I like to tick off whenever I finish a task and review them at the end of each day. But with that being said, I try not to be too harsh on myself if I don't complete a certain task on that day because you need time to rest your brain and take everything in, especially if you are learning concepts that are entirely new to you. So around noon, I decided to go drive to some of my favorite op shops. Also, I'm sorry, but I don't know why I always look half confused whenever I drive, so just ignore that. This is probably the best thrift store here because they have a huge collection of clothes for both men, women, and also for kids. I didn't get many shots here to be honest because I felt really self-conscious vlogging in public. But on a side note, if you are short or small like me, I suggest also browsing through the kids section because you may never know what you find in there. Like I'm sorry, I just had to get the sweater that I found from the boys section. Now the next op shop I went to is more of a secondhand furniture and homer store which I absolutely love. I was honestly resisting so hard from buying furniture because I know I don't have any more space in my room. I received Growmade's monitor stand. I was super excited to try this out as I'm currently using some of their products and they're all pretty high quality. All of their items are designed and handcrafted from the US. The setup was pretty simple, you just had to insert in these two core cards which will help hold the aluminium shelving. And then you just screw everything in and you're pretty much good to go. Be nice. 
Unfortunately though, my white monitor arm is screwed onto my desk, which prevents the stand to fit perfectly on my table. But regardless, I'll just quickly try and show you guys how it looks on my desk. Since my parents have their current work from home setup in the living room, I'm going to try and see if this monitor stand looks better on their table. It's actually been a couple of days later and I've decided to study for another online course that I signed up for. To be honest, the only reason why I took this was because it was on a discount, but I've actually really been enjoying it because I'm slowly remembering the things that I've learned about Python back when I took an engineering paper for it during first year of uni. For around noon, I decided to change the scenery and go outside. so I decided to go to this Korean place to get some bulgogi and y'all look at how good this looks So I'm actually pretty proud with how the cookies turned out. I know it doesn't look that great on camera, but I promise you it tastes so good and pairs so well with my matcha latte. Oh my god! Oh my god! That's hot! 